This week on The Amazing Race, the remaining teams travel to Colombia for an Expedia-designed leg, and we are unpacking it all. This was an action-packed episode. Oh, for One that, sure. one, not only looked super fun, but one that I actually feel like would be, like, attainable for anyone to achieve. Mm -hmm. Except if you're the twins, but we'll get to that later. <laughs> all so, right. tell me how this kicks off. So, we start off where there's, like, what, four groups that you're each mm -hmm. leave 15 minutes apart. But they have to, st for starting off, to get their first clue, go up these big stairs that are a big tourist place. Which there's go like up this rock that you yeah, see on screen right 600 now. 660, yeah. I think. It's and like my worst nightmare. The team's... You know, I was like, they're really just wearing them out instantly. Yeah. We start with the mega leg. Now we have to instantly climb these stairs. The yeah. Beginning. But all the teams did very well with this, I have yeah, to say. I like, was it sounds really daunting, but they kind of made it look easy. Yeah. I mean, a few of them, you know, the older teams kind of struggled. Sure. The mom from the mom and son yes. team, she kind of had to take it at a slow pace. She kind of struggles with everything, yeah. but I didn't say that out loud. But then once up there, they got their clue for the first detour. Right. Yeah. So. Well, from there, we, they, they have to do two detours. Yes. and But they have to take a boat first. Which I also think detour. is fun. It, it gives me very, like, James Bond, like, very action-packed yes. when they have to do all these different methods of getting around. I think right. that was really fun. And it was fun, you know, you saw them, like, trying to race each other in the water. Yeah. And then the, the poor mother uh, son <laughs> they can't got the one boat I know. where the motor went out. And I, I am curious how long the motor actually was, like, mm. stalled. I'd be curious to know Because, that like, too, it yeah. made it seem like a lot of teams passed them. Right. Like, did that really affect them yeah. as great as it did in Exa the Yeah. Yeah. But then once they get over to the other side of wherever they're, you know, the river or whatever, yeah. they, we, we'll start with the first detour of, a, like, a savory dish. Mm -hmm. So they had to make these... It honestly looked delicious, in yeah. my opinion. I wish we had a picture of the actual finished dish. I know. they all And they did a very good job, too, right? the teams. Yeah. But it was like you had to cook certain meats. There was like chorizo. Uh, you had to fry an egg. You had to make them for three abuelas. Yeah, and cooked very specifically, and, and the abuelas had to approve. Yeah, and they had to be displayed in this exact order, because uh, it's a very, I think, a traditional dish yeah, of Yeah, I think uh, so, Columbia. too. Yeah. But it looked... Delicious. It did look very good. I think it'd be fun to cook, but I always think about like how I'd be in these situations. And I think it so depends on who your partner is. Cause I think if like if it was Jory and I, I feel like we'd get yeah. like irritated with each other with the cooking because we'd be like mm -hmm. so trying to perfect what it is. You my know? thought was I have the hardest time frying eggs and making them actually. Oh my god, good. right. Okay. I I can make scrambled eggs and that's about it. Don't ask me to make anything else. So I just overcook the fried eggs. Usually. That's fair. And yeah. it looked like you, they were probably slightly runny eggs. Mm -hmm. And they looked so nice. But then on the other side of the detour, mm -hmm. we had a Jeep loading. Which this was the Hot Mess Express. This was the Hot Mess. So the twins and then our double dutch team mm -hmm. started doing this. They both decided, because you had to like load it up in a very specific manner. Yeah. And there was a lot of stuff. There was a lot a to lot. it. Yeah. But then they ended up, just both teams deciding to switch. Back to the, or over to the cooking. To the cooking. Yeah. Well, then once they get to the cooking, the, the double dutch team stays there. Yeah. The twins, for some reason, decide to switch back. Go back to the Jeep. Yeah. They start doing it, and then they decide to switch again. Yeah. And go back to cooking. So this is such a detrimental decision. Like I feel right. like that's like Amazing Race 101 is mm -hmm. like even though something's hard, you just have to stick with yeah. it and just fight it out. Like if you, you know? switch once, that's probably not going to be yeah. a detriment to you. But you switch three other times after going to the yeah. first one. You have to have a strategy. Like I remember, I don't remember what team it was, but last season one of the teams was like we had a strategy every time, and it was we would mm -hmm. never spend more than I think it was like 30 minutes on a challenge, and if we couldn't figure it out, we'd try the other one. Yeah. And I that makes sense. Saying that. Yeah. But and then you have the roadblock at the end. Yeah. Which I was called Who's Feeling Picky? Who's Feeling Picky? Yes. This was this looked fun. Also. Right. So they basically one of them had to pick, it was like a kilogram, I think, yeah. of of these coffee beans. Yeah. They call them cherries. Yeah. It was interesting. Um, but it was on this steep hill. Mm -hmm. And the double dutch team, her husband, had the God hardest he doesn't yeah. like heights. And you would have thought the man was on the <laughs> Grand Canyon staring down because he struggled to get no, down No, it was hill. so bad, but it was great TV. It was, it was great so TV. It was so funny, yes. but it's just like... Yeah, dude. yeah. So then our teams get to the pit stop. We have first place was Ricky and Caesar, which was exciting because they've been right there in second place mm -hmm. the first few episodes. Yep. So it's cool to see them get a first place finish. And then last place was unfortunately the twins Anthony and Bailey. They just couldn't get back from that detrimental decision me. they made. No, and I um, did chat with the twins Anthony and Bailey. So coming up, hear from them. We'll be right back. Ooh. 